Central America is a nation that I've wanted to play for a while, but I haven't because I've heard this nation is quite the headache to play. This nation is quite famous for not exactly lasting that long. In fact, this whole area is full of uh, countries that are famous for not exactly lasting that very long. Looks at Colombia, looks at Bolivia, Peru, looks at whatever this is in Brazil. So, do you know what? Let's just try. Let's just grab Central America by its long and guide it to economic success. How, how bad could this possibly be? And the first thing we get is bloody Central American desolation. We'll complete if it's 20%. Oh, oh, 25% of my country is already radical. Well, first of all, our government is unacceptable. So I want to try and fix that up real quick. I know that's going to have a hit on my on my stability, but we need this. Do I want the army in there or not, though? That's, that's, the, that's the question. Yeah, we'll, we'll put the army in there. How's that going to do? Okay, if our country is going to fall apart, do you think we should invest in the army? No, I, I would be lathe. Okay, I might take advantage of my uh, excess of grain. Export that to the, the Mexicans and maybe the Americans too. Let's see how this goes, gamers. Let's see how this goes. We're in the surplus. We have room to work with. It's mainly the rural folk that are angry at me. So already, in order to try and reduce radicals as much as possible, I'm going to lower the taxation level as, as low as possible. I normally have it on the highest, but oh my god. Uh, in terms of the decrees, what I might do is the agricultural ones. Should I? Um, we'll just do something like that. And how's my, how's my population doing? How's my population doing? Needs. I think we're doing pretty good on that we need furniture though we just i'm just gonna import uh as much as i need even at a loss because we need to get the radicals down as fast as possible so that my country does not implode and then stuff like tobacco i think we can export possibly fruit we have a lot of so fruit we can export uh perhaps we'll do that even at a loss We'll just, we'll just see how that goes and coffee. Yeah, it's a bit unorthodox from my usual um, economic strategy. I normally like to focus on the, the building materials first, but we don't have any construction sectors, so we don't need to worry about uh, fixing, say, the price of iron. Honduras succeeds. They will regret this betrayal. Oh, we can actually... Yeah, let's just go on it. Let's, let's go, let's go. <laughs> I thought there would be some sort of cooldown where you could not invade them at first, but no. We can literally invade them just as soon as they break away. They have no troops. <laughs> You're mine. Hi, I'm Bodhi. Nice to meet you. Maybe we could get some mobility. Maybe that will help. Uh, we'll, we'll try that, perhaps. How's our radicals doing? Our radicals? No! <laughs> no, the radicals are in crazy. Wait, 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 the armed forces. Age of Cordillas. Following our independence from Spain, a power vacuum was left in the place of the dismantled colonial governments. Okay, that's not really a concern for us. What is a concern for us is our bloody country falling apart. Not even flex tape can fix this because, oh my god, we're only a year, we're not even a year in the game. And our nation is already falling apart. Trust in the heroism. Do we want uh, a military government? Because if that bar gets full, uh, we are going to have well, essentially a military dictatorship or something like that. Why? Get back here. You're going straight down to the south there. We'll try and get Costa Rica uh, under control. Did our decree save? It didn't, but that's fine. Honduras will not be the agricultural powerhouse anymore. <laughs> Oh, our GDP is going up and down, isn't it? Uh, standard of living is increasing, so... But that only has such a small effect on the, the radicals in this country. Oh, my God. We're going to have to get, like, the max 27 standard of living in order to actually make the average Central American satisfied with the government. We've already got census suffrage, so that should be good. Cultural exclusion, too. We're actually quite progressive. It's not something I expected from Central America, but I guess you got to... You gotta do what you can. I don't want colonialism. Maybe a police? Ooh, but that's gonna risk us ever war, isn't it? But... I'm gonna try and get a dedicated police force. That is going to upset the... the what? Oh my god, Nicaragua? I thought you were on my side. You will regret this. I can't even bloody... Oh, bloody. I just have to capitulate there so that we can get a war over here. Oh, I gotta hate my life. Costa Rica is free, but not the love. Oh, how's that gonna go? 52%? Maybe we can 
increase the wages over there. What? I hate my life so much. What is this? Oh. <laughs> And it was going so well. What's up, everyone? It's me, Colombia. Welcome to uh, whatever this video is. Just like how Senor Hilter fled from Germany to Argentina, I fled from Central America to Colombia. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna invade the place. This is my only chance to get revenge on Costa Rica. Costa Rica is the one nation that I couldn't properly subdue because uh, Nicaragua got in the way of that. What the hell? It's time to do, 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 do. How do you like me now, Costa Rica? How do you like me now? Okay, we do have a pretty good economy though. Landed voting. So we could probably actually get away with doing a construction sector. I think that might actually benefit us greatly. And then we can uh, use that to build our economy further. Start the construction loop. How is our market going with, with um, the building materials though? Do we have coal in this country or iron? We are not mining any coal or iron. But I know there is some in Central America that is. But we do have adequate coal and iron here. Ah yes. What do we what do we not have at the moment? Uh, we could do iron frame buildings. Uh, in terms of iron frame, we we need tools and iron. So we'll just import. That's going to be at a loss though, isn't it? At first. But yeah, once we get that all going, then uh everything will be poggers. So we'll just get the uh, we'll just get the iron mine going first. I wanna get that. I wanna get that going first before we do that uh banana plantation. So we're just gonna deficit spend for a while, but we have the gold reserves. We have enough gold for years, so. But that's it for Central America. I mean, Colombia. Thank you for watching. I, I got my revenge as I wanted. Uh, was it worth it? Probably not. Well, yeah, bye.